トルグリッツーシューズOkay, so I was gonna give Botrix time to show up, but I don't think Botwix is showing up, so we're just gonna- we're just gonna- we're just gonna get started, okay? How is everyone? What's poppin'? What's shaking? You know, what's- what's the 411? How is everyone doing today? Huh? <laughs> if- even when I'm late, I can at least say that I'm not a lady to Botwix. No, I just wanted to see if I had any mail. I actually forgot about that. Uh, what was I doing? Actually, I forgot. What day are we on? Tuesday. Oh, okay, okay. What kind of pizza? That'll determine whether everything is fine or not. Y you have one chance to say the right answer. <laughs> and, and if you don't, uh, you're gonna perish. Oh, you have a- there's a lot of sanity. Okay. Uh... Map. Meat lovers. Okay. Not my favorite, but I can see- I can- I can... Yes, what is your favor? A anything for you.
Pizza Hut and have buy one, get one? Put my hand up as high in the air as it'll go? Oh, hey, Botwix! Ah, uh, nice. My hand is up in the air as high as it'll go. Why? My chat is broken. Wait, do you want me to put both my hands up as high in the air as it'll go? So I'll do that too. No! <laughs> That's not the height of the average person. I'm, I'm the height of the average person. I'm not that short. And I'm and, and I'm and I'm still growing. Wait, wasn't that where I get bread? I think that's where I get bread. Actually, no. There's the swing. If I was short... Would I... I don't know. I, I'd be something. I'd be something. Bruh. I can't believe it. Oh, I thought that the bread was on sale. <laughs> I saw the red line, I'm like, oh, it's on sale? Don't mind if I do. I, I cry. I cry. Um, let me go ahead and put the bread in my stash. No, actually, I don't need it. I just go into town, see what the quest is gonna make me do. See how I'm gonna have to persuade people to not suspect me. Hmm. Do folks usually gather here? <laughs> I wonder if something happened. I think it was a little snitch. Uh, da da da. Find out what happened. Oh, there's people. Hello. Mr. Eugene's horses got stolen. What? Is this true? I'm not a liar. Yes, I'm afraid it's true. Everyone's acting strange, Elise. That's natural, my dear. This isn't something to take lightly. I haven't heard some folks say that we were hag-ridden. Hag-ridden? You shouldn't spread such nonsense about town. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that name. So it's, it's grunge for right now. <laughs> but old Johan said that the horses were stolen by the witch. Oh, for goodness sake. The poor lad couldn't be more heartbroken. For good reason. Go on now. I'm looking after the children for the time being. Is that what happened? Or is there is there more? Uh, Find out what happened. Yes, I'm aware. Um, let me see if there's any flags that'll tell me where to go. No? Okay. I guess it might be here. What's in the church? No one's in the church? No wonder Father Hans is such a miserable witch. I would be too if I had to read this gibberish all day. Thank you, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate you even coming out to hang. I remember sneaking into Father Han's study when Lev and we were children. These two rooms have nothing but junk in them, anyhow. Let's see. I've never seen water coming out of here. I wonder if they've ever been used for anything. The pearly stone basin sits untouched. Uh, let's see if there's anyone upstairs. No? Anything? The fragrant mountain. Osu bleh. 
Look, okay, oats is pretty fun if you're not trash at it like I am. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Let's go up this way. There is literally no one. Uh, let's see. These are old requests for Miss Marielle. I suppose some of the townsfolk still gather here, even though she's moved across the street. I've been told it was Freya's mother who decorated their home. Oh, this is Freya's house. Okay. Let's see if she's home. No? Nothing? Um... There's a lot of kitties. Um, mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, there's some people. There you are, you two. You're not look looking so cheerful, Miss Lisbeth. Oh, it's difficult to stay cheerful with all these going on. It's so unfortunate. You have to wonder who'd do such a thing. It can't have been easy, that's for certain. Now, Lisbeth's ghosts are feeling ill, too. Oh, Ariane. I'm at such a loss. Feeling ill, Miss Lisbeth? The milk's giving off this foul smell since yesterday. They call that refrigeration. Their eyes are looking glossy, too. I don't know what to think of it. The only one who could lend me a hand is you, Yugen, but you wouldn't want to trouble him, I see. It'll be fine, my dear. We'll have a word with Father Hans, all right? Okay, so are we trying to find Father Hans? Oh, well, I guess that answers my question. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Mm. You two have heard, I'm sure. We have. Though, so we're trying to figure out what happened. I'm ruined, that's what happened. <sighs> As I said before, Eugene, we will do all we can to help. We'll gather the lads and send them out to patrol the outskirts. Mm. Are we absolutely certain they were stolen? About that, Elise. Those horses were haggard, and I tell you. Not this nonsense again. I tell you, lad, there's a witch in Kefferberg. Even if they were Hadrigan, it's still a sad day for Mr. Eugen. Old oh, Johan. This isn't the time. I'll ask you not to try folks' patience, old oh, Johan. Yes! I said the right thing! <laughs> or anyone else's for that matter. Hmm. Witch or no witch, folks. Someone had to do it. No two ways about it. With as much as a trot or a neigh. All there was when I got here this morning were Bernard's pigs in a saddle. Oh, there's a pig in a saddle. Don't rope me into this, lad. I already told you I had nothing to do with it. Who am I to blame, then? The witch? Hmm. Let's keep calm now, folks. I just realized... He looks like Voldemort. <laughs> oh, and there goes one man. <sighs> Can't fault the poor lad for it, can we, folks? Then Guido and I will take a look around the outskirts. I'll go with you, Gustav, and we should ask Yugen if he'd like to join us, too. Is there any way we can help? Keep folks calm, Elise, and go about your day as you normally would. Leave it to us, lads. We'll get to the bottom of this. Hmm. Folks truly are on edge today. I have to be careful with what I say about town. Alright, let's go do some work. Uh, let's see. Who needs help? Meet Roz and Marie at the crossroads. Oh, yeah, I got a romantic event to do. I have maidens to seduce. I run. <laughs> oh, there she is. Let's see. Hello, hello, child. Pretending not to see me, were you? For goodness sake, Maggie. I don't have time for this. Give me the grape juice, Elise. 
I didn't have breakfast today, so that's it. I'm telling your auntie you're begging for food again. But I'm not begging. I, I, I saw you have a goat now. Why? Am I not allowed to have a goat? Golly, you're dirt poor. How would you g get your hands on a g goat? Why, you? I see we have an understanding, Elise. Now pass the grape juice or someone's getting an ear... I don't have grape juice. I'll give you a pretzel. This will have to do, Mucky. That's all I have on me. That said, you ought to stop terrorizing me every day, or... You're mocking me, aren't you? Why, you ungrateful glutton! Br bring me some lebuk chen tomorrow. I may forgive you if you bring me... Oh, I'll throw you in the well. Come here this instant. And then the child runs away. Oh! I just gave her my pretzel and it still put my suspicion up by two?! Oh, 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 okay. Apparently I gotta do really good at these minigames. Or else I'm... Oh. E. That was a concerning amount of suspicion. Alright, let's see. Nope, I don't want to talk to you right now. I want to talk to Milady. Who's one more down. Let's see. Oh, there she is. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Yes, of course. <laughs> it is. Oh, I'm so glad you came, Elise. Anything to get me out of that rat hole. And to think I have to deal with those folks all day. <laughs> I can lend you a hand, Elise. Whatever you need. Uh, that aside, Roz. What was it you wanted to show me? Uh, uh, this is somewhat embarrassing, but... Look at this, Elise. A pinecone? That's what you wanted to show me? Uh, uh, uh It's more important than you think. This pinecone is my treasure, Elise. Huh? Granny gave it to me when I was little. Your granny, huh? I understand how she feels, I suppose. We're just the same as this pinecone, Elise. How am I the same as a pinecone, Roz? Uh, I promise there's a proper meaning to what I just said. Alright, alright. Our time here in this realm is rather limited, isn't it? I suppose. You see how the pinecone is covered with scales? If you think of it as yourself and your life up until this moment, you can understand how each scale represents something, right? I see. Your experiences and dreams and the things that you hold dear. All those things are just the same as the scales in this pinecone. Roz, there are times when, when one falls off or gets damaged and you don't feel as whole anymore, but... You learn to be without it, and find that losing one doesn't mean that you'll lose all the others. Oh, Elise! <laughs> this pinecone is a representation of my path. That is a gremlin face right there, if I've ever seen one. I've been meaning to tell you all about it for so long. Oh, for goodness sake. All these scales represent the path I've taken to reach you. And now that I'm by your side, I feel whole like never before. You see what I mean, don't you, Elise? I do, I do. Oh, I'm so glad I could finally tell you about it. Block is one of the one of these skills too. Did you know that he's uh, breathe, 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 girl. Y you make me whole, Elise. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Blush, 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 blush. Oh, don't get flustered. I'll get flustered, too. Oh, shut it, you. Come now. We ought to head back to town. Isn't she? I love her. Won't you meet me at the viewpoint tomorrow morning? All right, all right. I'll be spending all my time with you at this rate. Oh, if you're too busy, then... Oh, for goodness sake. Uh, wait. Elise... I have a piece of her heart! <laughs> I'll take it! 
It was worth the time. All right, now let's go get some money so I can buy the lead, 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 lead for her, or else she's gonna snitch on me. Oh, meat raws at the viewpoint. Okay, items, food. There we go. So I need to get at least 30 gold, I think. Uh, what's my... Freak Freya, I'm sorry. All I can do is help with the chickens. Or chop wood. I'll just do whatever comes for it, whichever one pops up first. I don't know which one that is, but we'll figure it out, right? Part of me wants to be, like, a little bit more experimental with, like, what, you know, you do or do not. What happens when your sanity or whatever goes too low. But at the same time, I'm like, eh. Child. There we go. Let's see what you want. Uh, how glad I am to see you, Elise. How can I help, Miss Dorothy? I'd be very grateful if you could collect some eggs. Of course. Give me some money. Give me some money. It'll cost you two extra bread. Oh my god. Out of my way, you feathered rat! Alright, it's time to put on my gamer face. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm practically a pro at this, right? Come on. There we go. Oh, gosh. No! <laughs> uh, so about being a pro at this. To like retry it. Oh no. good, right? 47? Okay, I gotta be. I gotta be. That'll be enough to buy the cookies. No, I don't have enough money to try again. Unfortunately. But I passed, and so that's okay. That's, that's all I need. Ah, uh, there you are. Thank you so much for your time. At least you didn't insult me this time. Um, okay. So let's see. Do I have any food? No, I don't. Okay, let me go and get a piece of bread. And then I will go and do another chore. Up, Roz. Where am I at, actually? There we go. No, not that way. There we go. No. Uh, I heard there was a whole ordeal to get this grindstone down the hill. The worn down, rough looking sandstone sits at the centerpiece of a resting area. Couldn't be me. You know, actually, is it bad that I don't know my way back? <laughs> I think I do actually have to go up and then down. Let's see, let's just... 
make my way around the long way. There we go. And then we go down. Oh. Seems like they're back from looking for the horses, but... Horseshoes scattered about, you say? Found them just past logging grounds, but... Why in the Lord's name would anyone remove horseshoes? I wouldn't want to lend weight to old Joseph's nonsense, but... Wake up, lads! They were Hagrid, and I tell you! This isn't the time, old Johan. We must keep calm. Thank you for your time today, lads. I'll be moving along now. I've had enough of wandering about. Poor Yugen. I must feel bad for the guy. I've never seen him so disheartened, I must say. I think you lads didn't find even a trace. We looked everywhere, Miss Marlin. The peaks, the lake. Heinrich and Tristan even followed the path of Primmeldorf. Hmm. We ought to give it another try first thing. Oh, there's a child. Oh, no. Ah, I found it! I found it! I found the horse! It's right right outside! What are you saying, Maggie? Does no, no one call her by her name? I... It's the truth! It's lying on the ground! Is it alive? Take us to it, Lassie! Oh, it is alive, but she- but the thing, poor thing's struggling. My word! Oh, the poor thing! Good grief, it's nearly dead! What do you make of it, Yugen? He's exhausted. I'd say he ran here by the looks of it. No, that can't be. We've only just made it back. We would have found him or heard him or... I must say, I'm at a loss, lads. They were haggard no two ways about it. Look at the look at it, gasping for breath, ill. Look at its eyes. It got them crazy eyes. Keep calm, old Johan. Think you can nurse him back to health, Yugen? I'm taking him back to the stables right now. Good luck carrying a horse. I'll land a hand. You fools not ought to touch that horse. Lord knows what the witch has done to it. Come now, lads. Let's go fetch him some water. He must have broken free from wherever he was being kept, I suppose. Broke off the reins and ran back to Kefferberg. I can't think of... Nonsense, Bernard! I'll have it said right here, right now, folks! It's best you show some restraint, old Johan. This isn't... Old Stefan warned us about this! Oh, not this old Stefan nonsense again. You old fool. We need to keep calm, folks. Arguing about this won't... Have you no memory of his words, Hans? Gustav! He spoke of the ill fortune we'd have of the witch. Of folks' livelihood slipping through their fingers. <sighs> old Stefan was tormented loud on his deathbed, of Johan. There is worse to come, folks. Mark my words. Hmm. What are we to do with him, father? Just wait for him to tire himself out. That's all we can do. Come, folks. Let's head back to town. Look, man. I just wanted to buy some bread. Hmm. Things are starting to get a little out of hand, aren't they? Willing to bet the horse went into the woods because they didn't say that they checked there. Something, something, I think we've entered the second act. Uh, wait, was it down this way? I think it was one more over. There we go. Hello, hello, Grandma. Uh, let me just buy a single thing of bread to get me through. I won't be able to get my fr I won't be able to get Roz's help for the next one, so I'm gonna have to say see you.
Items. Bread. Yes, give me that grain. Uh, and then there's a chore right in there. Okay, cool. Or actually, there's one right here. Okay, what, what's, what's this one? Play Kiss the Rat with Jacob. I think I'd rather take my chances with the apples. Go. Oh, Elise. Feeling the pressure, Miss Linda? Aren't we all? I hate to ask, but could you fetch me some apples, my dear? Of course. I'll be on my way. Thank you, Elise. I have my hands full with supper, you see. No. I don't have enough. How many apples do these folks need, anyhow? Apples are pretty good. Yeah, I probably just have to go back and forth and, like, pick them up. Yeah. That's- that's just a nice, easy one. And then watch, I'm gonna, like, fail it extremely hard. There we go. See? I'm practically a professional. See? God gamer. Watch, I'm gonna get like an eh. Oh wait, there's a second round. There we go. Oh, crud. I caught the last one. That's good luck, right? Probably. <laughs> it gave me a B? Oh. No, it's not worth it. I missed like three apples! Oh, okay, okay, I still get- I think I still got 32. So there we go, I can buy some bread, and then I can save... Yeah, I, I think- I can make- I can make this work. Let me go... Elise! Oh, what does this old hag want now? Where do you think you're going, Elise? Huh? I need to have a word with you. What's this about, Miss Bertha? Your cousin! That's what this is about, Elise. The lass has been wandering about town, you know? She's been helping me out, Miss Bertha. No, I don't think so, Elise. Your cousin's been telling folks there's no thief in Kefferberg. Uh... So that's old Johan. He's been sissing on the hag riding, hasn't he? Oh, Jehan is one, is one thing, but your cousin has no right to be spreading such nonsense, Elise. Alright, I can have a word with her. Ah! Oh. She you meet everyone in town, but will inevitably raise suspicion if left alone for too long. As often as possible, her face of villagers' wrath. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Here, c c let me get my daily bread pretty, please. I thought you'd never come about, Elise. Oh, spare me. Here's your bread, Elise. You must keep yourself fed. I should have been- I should have been statching up on food, shouldn't I? You too, Leb. You're looking just as tired as I am. Can you tell? You're not as mysterious as you think you are. Dot dot dot. Now, th now that's better! Move along, Elise. It's best we head to bed early tonight. 
Oh, the Lord knows I can use some good sleep. How is he to know when you hardly ever pray, Elise? It's not as though he makes for good conversation, so why bother? Good night, Leb. Good night, Elise. Okay, so let me go... Buy the annoying child some cookies. Let me buy... Oh, it hurts me. This hurts me. Now go ahead and buy some cookies. Anything else? No. See you, Granny. Uh, items. There we go. So that's enough for now. Let's go and have dinner with Leb. Right? Oh. I, I, I wish I had a pretty lady give me bread every day. But no, I have to be go I have to go get it myself and usually my cats eat it. Also, hi Rainer. <laughs> That's Mr. Eugen's. You've come, you've come. Are the birds talking? Oh no, it's a big bird. This crow, it's speaking to me. You're wearing them, you're wearing them. Shiny, shiny, shiny. I like shiny. What's the meaning of this? Who's there? The hex, the hex. You're the bearer of the hex. Hex? What hex? The hex, the hex. You've heard of it. You're wearing it as we speak. The hex. Okay, that's enough of that. Stay away! Show it to me! Show it to me! I have nothing to show you! Go away! Why, yes you do! Your desire! Your fervent greed! Your boundless hunger for glory! Show it to us! <laughs> dun, dun, dun. What the heck? My- my eye! What have you done to my eye? Show it to us! Show it to us! You wretch! The testament to your tender flesh is awaiting you in my grove. A testament! Our grove! Our grove! Wait, you! I'm awaiting you, Elise, in my ceramic grove of wheat. A testament. Anyhow, I ought to let Mr. Eugen know about his horse. I think I could do that now, right? Yeah, let me go. I'm not even gonna waste my matches because this is probably a safe area. All right, where's Mr. Eugen? There's Mr. Eugen. Let me save lest I increase my suspicion anymore. I should have saved earlier because then I could have gone back and do that little cutscene again. There we go. There we go. Let's see what they have to say. Mr. Yugen! Good lord, Elise! What's got you in such a hurry? There's a horse in the crossroads! Are you certain, Elise? Yeah. Yes, yes, I'm certain. Lass says she found your horse, Yugen. Take me there, Lass. I'll go fetch the others. But it's dead, Mr. Yugen. It matters not, Lass. Take me there. Wait, didn't we already find the horse? It, it was right here, I swear! Good lord, Elise. Would you tell us what you saw, Elise? There were crows, and the horse was... Are you certain this is where you saw it? Yes! Yes, I am! You're tired, Elise. I'm certain this was just... There's only one answer to this, folks. You're lying, Elise! I'm not lying, you old fool! If you'd let me explain, I could tell you! You said the horse was dead, Elise. And it was! 
How could a dead horse trot away, would you say? It's no use trying to reason with her, Tristan. She's lying. Oh, Elise. Of all things to lie about. And what is it about those crows? It's the truth! I've had enough. I'll be in the stables. It is a Elise? Hmm. Tell us, Elise. Are you speaking the truth? Uh, which one's not going to raise my suspicion? I'll try this one, because I saved right before I did this, so... Uh... Yet, yeah, I'm not certain. I could have sworn. What do you mean you're not... Mm. I'm simply not, old Joseph. Maybe I, I may be too tired. It's... Mm. I can accept that, at least. Hmm. But I can't, Gustav. She still has to explain the crows. There were crows, too. So ah! Uh, uh, Mr. Gustav, I never lie about such a... Can't you see, Gustav? She's trying to confuse us. You shouldn't make such... I'm telling the truth, you old... That's enough. We've all had a difficult day today, folks. We're all exhausted, drained, and on edge. Are we not? Why, you trying to defend your... No, Lebs, right, right, old Johan. Let's turn in for the night. We can come back to this tomorrow. I'd like to have a word with you, Gustav. You too, Leb. Mm. No need. I trust Leb's judgment. <sighs> Yet I don't. So... <gasps> You're going home, Elise, and you should think long and hard about what you've done. Okay, I'm gonna- I'm gonna- Is it cheating if I go back and try it again? How do I- how do I load a save? That was dangerous. I'm worried about Leb, but I ought to go home and tell Roz about what I just saw. No, actually, we're gonna load my previous save because... <laughs> I wonder if there was a way I could just, like, simply choose to not tell him about the horse. Yeah, 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 yeah. yes, yes, yes. Yes, I'm certain. Take me there, I'll go fetch the others. Oh, my shift, it goes faster through cutscenes. Yes, I'm certain this is where I saw it. I can tell you... I'll be in the stables. There we go. It's not, che it's not cheating. It's using my resources. They were crows, too. Wait. Wait, did I pick the right option? Wait, hold on. No. Uh, was there no way to get out of raising my suspicion? Let me try the other option. Okay, one one more time. <laughs> oh, did I? I I was I was rushing a little bit. But that's okay. Now that I figured out how to speed through cutscenes. Easy peasy. We're gonna get we're gonna get the good ending. Yeah, come on. Maybe I'm just tired. I can accept that, but I can't. As I said, father. I think I saw what I saw. I won't deny any of what I said. I'm just shocked to see there's nothing here, though. I truly wouldn't lie about such a thing. You think you've got us fooled, huh? Ugh. See, see, no suspicion. Totally did it right the first time. You shouldn't make such education uh, blah, blah, blah. accusations. It's best we... Can't you folks see she's trying to deceive us? 
You know something, Elise? What? I don't know what it is, but I'll have it said, Lassie. You can dance with the devil all you want, but you won't. That's enough. We've all had a difficult day today. We're all exhausted, drained, and on edge. Are we not? Why, you? Trying to defend your... No, Lebs, right? Let's turn in for the night. We can come back to this tomorrow. I'd like a word with you, Gustav. You too, Leb. No need, Father. I trust Leb's judgment. Yet, I don't. I'll go with you, Father. You're going home, Elise, and you should think long and hard about what you've done. Dot, dot, dot. Easy peasy. <laughs> that was dangerous. I'm worried about Leb, but I ought to go home and tell Roz about what I just saw. Let's just save. Easy peasy. And now we go home, sweet home. There we go, and we go up. And this way. Oh, uh, actually, what's my sanity at? It's about half. Okay, I think it's I think it's fine. Home sweet home. <laughs> Elise. This is bad. It's very bad. Had it not been for Lev, those folks would have They would have found out about everything. About the woods, about what I did. That's right, I best get to that crow's grove. The testament, they have the tender flesh. I should... At least... Ross. What's wrong, Elise? Giving moths a... Okay, no, the moths are evil in this game, okay? They're scary. I'm so tired. It's this, it's this rotten pig side of a town. Elise. I saw one of Mr. Eugen's horses on the way home, Roz. It was dead, but it was riddled with crows, and... I don't understand, Elise. You should tell... More importantly, Roz... There was a golden crow. He said he's got a testament. Oh, Elise, a testament. I'm... This is too much for me, Roz. What else did he say, Roz? I'm so tired. Huh? Huh? I ran back to town to tell everyone about the horse, and they... They humiliated me, Roz. Elise. Each and every day, I'm treated as though I'm some wretch. No matter what I do or say, I'm always, always... Dot, dot, dot. This wish of mine, Roz. Can I truly trust him to grant it? If you devote yourself to him and do his bidding, you're already aware of the sacrifices you'll have to make, but... Nah, mo moths... I think moths are cuter than butterflies, personally. But, but, in this in this scenario, I, thi I, th I think they're moths. They're kind of colorful, so they might not be. They might actually be butterflies, but it would fit in with more with, like, the nighttime spooky woods. I would sacrifice all of Kefferberg if I had to, Roz. Dot, dot, dot. I can't stay another day in this town. I have no choice but to find him. Take me with you, Elise. Huh? You're going there again tonight, aren't you? To the woods? Mm. All right, I'll I'll let you know when I'm on, when I'm ready. All right, let's what's on my what's on the agenda? Okay, there's nothing. I just got to talk to her and continue. You look nervous, Elise. Mm. That's because I am, Roz. We can talk about it. I can try and no, it, it's all right. I, I don't want to think about it. Honestly, if that's not a mood. Let's go, Roz. All right.
going into the woods with no healing items and a chronic skill issue. He close to be Roz. Lo Lord knows what we're gonna find. You saw how it told me about last evening. Fair enough. Whatever happens, promise me you'll stay close. Of course, Elise. Is everything all right? Come, let's go. All right, let's get back to the woods. Yes, Lamp Cone is my best friend. Especially in this game. Maybe I Maybe I am a moth. I am become moth. Uh the woods are down this way. Right? No? Maybe? You think? You think I'd be better about remembering how to get from place to place, considering, but you'd be wrong. This is where it happened, Roz. At least look! Yep. Called it that the horses went into the woods. Those are horseshoes! There are so many, too! These weren't here earlier, Roz. Secret moth model? <laughs> Maybe, maybe, maybe there is a secret moth model. You don't know? It doesn't make any sense. Hmm. There are feathers scattered about, too. Are these from the crows you said you saw? Hmm. I don't know what to make of this, Roz. Come, Elise. We have no choice but to see for ourselves. Wait, Roz! God dang it, I just told her to stay close to me! Stay close to me. I I will. I will, Elise. Proceeds to run in head first. Roz. Roz. Silly lass. She must have wandered in all by herself. She's gonna get the broom. Oh. Welcome to the witching hour. Let's see. There's a burb. Oh, did I step on a trap? Oh, 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 oh. Well, this is... Roz! Roz! Where in the Lord's name did she go? I best carry on, I suppose. There's no going back. It won't let me run. This game wouldn't leave me in a place where I'm, like, in danger but couldn't run, right? There we go. Pleasant surprise, pleasant surprise. How pleasant it is to see you here, lass. I thought we were the ones that invited me, Crow. Very, very ominous, yes. It's like when you get stocked up. It's the inverse of when you're stocked up on, like, health and ammo. When you're playing a shooter or, like, just any kind of game. Not every lass who gets those shoes winds up here. There have been others. You're not special. Oh, well, I see how it is. There we go, now I can run. Oh, well, there's Roz. Roz! What were you thinking, wandering off like that? You... Uh, I'm sorry. I told you to stay close to me. And she walks away even more. I got a little distracted, is all. This isn't the time or the place to get distracted, you dummy! This is why I'm gonna hit you with the broom. We don't know what could be in these woods. I don't think we're in the- Oh. 
I don't think that's Roz. Come now, we can't sit around all night. Yes. All right, let's do a little party talk. This is such a bizarre place. It's so different from the last night, too. Their influence is rather noticeable, isn't it? Whose influence? Uh, of course, who else? I suppose... Nothing? Okay. I'm just gonna try and, like, find some of these, like, little pots. Let's see if any of them, you know, have any goodies for me. Because I really didn't think about buying health... Health or sanity items before I uh went into the witching hour. I don't want matches, I want torch I mean I want heals. Please, game. I'm just a fragile little little man. Okay, nothing back there. Another hand touches the beacon. Acquired the wing of something. Question mark? A ring? That's the crows! What did you say, Roz? My eye! You've come! You've come! Oh, well, snap back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Look who it is! Look who it is! You've brought me such good company, too. What are you wittering about, you wretch? You've done well in coming here, lassie. So you best give me what you promised, Crow. What he promised? The testament, the testament. Where is it, Crow? Come a little further into my grove, lass. Why, you little... I didn't hear about this. Show it to me. Show it to me. What did you want... What is it she to show... Words. Wow. Okay. What is she to show you, Crow? Uh, why- why would you hurt yourself like that? Shun, you gotta take care of yourself. I know you're probably trying to defeat- keep your arch nemesis off the leaderboards, but that's not more important. Roz? Goodness gracious. I'm gonna have to hit you with the broom, too. Hey, give me back that ring, you- Show me how far those ruby shoes will take you. All that you desire, lass, is also close yet so far. You can at least tell me your name, Crow, if you have one. That's a secret. Of course it is. Why, you wretched bird that doesn't answer my... Enough chatting. Time to fly. Come find me if you'd like to know more. Why do I feel like I'm talking to a telemarketer? Come find me. I suppose we ought to go find him. What's gotten into you, Roz? You're not yourself. What do you mean? Oh, to hell with it. Let's go find that... Heckin' bird. Let's see. I don't think we should trust that crow. Alright, out with it, Roz. You haven't been yourself since we got here. I'm a little nervous is all. So am I, but you're... It's best we don't get distracted now. And maybe she's truly nervous, but she's rather cold, isn't she? Have I not romanced her enough? That ring we found. Would you say it could go in here, Roz? He did steal it from us, after all. Ever clever, isn't she? Some of these look like they have nests inside. Can I just break them? No? Okay. I know, I know, I understand. Oh. Uh, which one opened? Wait a second. So I was standing right here. Ah, well that's helpful. Um... 
Oh, this one. Let me save again. Is this a maze of birds? A braze? Oh, oh, oh. Whoops. They were all shaking, weren't they? Because I think I just gotta make my way down. I'm so lost. I, I I don't see any way through. Or do I need to just go to the ones that aren't shaking? Okay, so now that one's shaking. Am I basically playing Frogger but with birds? for that one to stop shaking so I can go get that pot. Ah, gosh darn it! Okay, I'm slowly figuring it out. Slowly but surely. Give me a healing item. Give me a healing item. No! Wait, maybe that's a healing item. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna get my hopes down. It heals! Oh, hello, Mr. Crow. We always keep our promises last. There's nothing to fear. I'm yet to see it happen, Crow. Fear not. Fear not. Say, you're one of the Golden Crow's crooks, aren't you? A crook, she says. A crook. What else am I to call you? Birdie. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay. 
Yo. God gamer. Give me the ring back. Oh, I dropped it. Yay. Oh, please don't tell me I have to make my way back now. Oh, I thought we wouldn't see the end of it. Come now, let's get out of here. I'm not sure it's that easy. Huh? No, it's nothing. Let's go. Cool. Oh. I acquired the ring of... Alright, now we go save so I don't ever have to do that one again. Uh, where's... Where is it? There it is. Thank you. Alright, what do you have to say, Roz? Finding that crow in here is gonna be rather... It's a matter of following his trail, I'd say. Whichever trees don't move, that ought to lead us to him. You seem to know quite a bit about all this. Uh, I tend to know a great deal about things, don't I? This doesn't feel right at all. She won't even say my name. Let's see. So we take the... Ought to find the wretched crow. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Items. Oh, and max match torches, I think. Or lanterns, I'm sorry. I love when we get the, the ring back from the crow just to give it back to him. And there goes our elevator. Your chariot arrives, my lady. He will be pleased. He will be pleased. Where's the testament? Come further, lass. Come further. Oh, I've had it with you. Either tell me where to find it or get out of my sight. It's best you don't speak to him like that. Huh? All the answers you seek lie deeper within the woods, lassie. Will you give me the tender flesh, then? Meet me in the wheat field. Show me your resolution. The wheat field? You have my word. Huh. That wretched bird's playing with me. A wheat field. Roz. It's nothing. We ought to get, go after him. Hmm. She's not nervous. She's hiding something. That's not Roz. This isn't Milady. I'll deal with Roz later. Oh, he doesn't even want to talk to her. Let's go this way first. Let's see what they have to say. I see you've taken the Marquis invitation. It's rather rude to arrive in such good company, however. To whom? You know who. To, you know who. To him. That's who the good company is for, not for his Marquis. Cooking stream? No, I, I can't cook. In fact, I'm actually not even going to be having Thanksgiving dinner. I'll be going to a casino. Not nonsense. Oh, shush, you feathered rat. Oh, there's one of the golden miladies. How I loathe you, naive sheep. Following his blissful word into this moonless hellfire of ours. What are, what are you? He all fed his gluttony, one after the other. Our sins on earth made into a spectacle for all to see. Who is he? Your fate as one of us is sealed, you foolish girl. What in the Lord's name is she wittering on about? Alright, so horse, cat, horse. So it's true, it's true. I'll never get used to you feathered rats screeching. She's here, she's here. It's best we move along. She brought the witch, she brought the witch! What are they going on about now, Roz? You're in our lair, witch. You have no hand in this grove. You've got the wrong last crows. I suppose it's because of the hat? You're in our lair, the lair of Lord... The lair of Lord... Do you know who that is, Roz? You know him too. He's our merciful Marquis. That golden crow's name. 
It's best we move along now. Let's see. I'm sorry. What for, Roz? I'm aware I'm a little antsy, but this place just makes me nervous, you see? That's all right, I suppose. I'm not too pleased to be here either, but... But? I can't tell her I was hoping she'd be a little bit more supportive. I'm not even certain what I was expecting by bringing her here. Is everything all right? It's best we stick together, Roz. Here we go. I'm just looking for pots. You've met them. You've met them. You're mocking me, you. So are they. Those wretched black birds. All of them. His sick bleh, words. What are you talking about? Blah, blah, blah. His faithful crow. Don't trust him, regardless of how friendly he appears. As if I trust that feathered rat. I acquired some hearty soup. Oh, I lose sanity every time I talk to one of them. Doesn't seem to be working. Okay. Uh, items. I might have to go sell that. Ooh. Gonna go ahead and eat that, actually. Let's see. Anything else? Invisible wall? Invisible wall. Invisible wall? Invisible wall. An actual wall. Safe point. Don't mind if I do. Alright, let's see. Down and around. Oh, I just had it. There we go. Up ahead, up ahead. What's up ahead, pro? Lord, 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 Lord. Can't you give it a rest with the squawking? If you give it the rest, give it a rest with your own whine. Oh, the bird got some little sassy man. I've had it with you in your Lord, 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 Lord. right above yon these walls. Why you? This place is nothing but walls. You best find your way out then. Okay, so I guess this is a maze I'm getting ready to go through, and it's probably deadly, given that they gave me a save point. Okay, yep, purple corn, bad idea. Okay, but they can be avoided. There we go. I got a leather purse! Okay, so that's easy, that's easy. Is. Game. Anything? No. Um. Don't quite know how close I can get without. Eager to meet him. Eager to meet him. For goodness sake. These crows truly enjoy mocking us, don't they? You'll enjoy his company, I'm certain. And why'd you say such a thing? Lord la la la, Lord la 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 does. So no wonder he does, Crow. How do you know that, Roz? She's the witch, she's the witch. No, oh, for goodness sake. Why is it that I have to listen to this nonsense everywhere I go? Come, Roz, I've had enough of this foolery. Okay. 
see. I don't really know how ambitious I can get with with where I'm going. He <laughs> they ran into each other. Ooh. Okay, okay. There's some sparklies right there. More matches. I'm still capped out, so I can't really use them, but... There's a good chance I might... Oh, there's a... There we go. Okay. Well, I got a use for those matches now. <laughs> Okay, so I can sell those. There we go. More acorns. The right way. Might be the right way. I think it, it looks like the right way. It's him. Mateo. The man behind the slaughter. Wait, you. Uh, he sure likes to be chased around, huh? huh? Coming out. Let's go before he decides to fly away again. Let's see, anything lootable? See, I know- A crow slate? What's this stone slab? Let's find a way to open all of these. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk to him. Fancy seeing you! Fancy seeing you! Your resolve! Oh, I have plenty of that. Don't provoke him. Provoke me! Provoke me! Follow your instinct, lass. Pay no heed to this creature you've brought along. She's no creature, you wretch! Yet, since you assist... I've heard a few things from those birds, but... Such as... Lord Lula, the crow's Marquis, they called you. His faithful Marquis. Would you give the parroting a rest? You're my lair, lass. Lord Lula, ceramic grove of wheat. Ruler of all feathered creatures. Ruler of all... F to undergo your trial, I suppose. As many have, as many have. About this trial, Crow. It's my understanding that you'll be granting me one of these testaments. The tender flesh. The tender flesh. You've given me your word. Be sure you see it through. You hear? Find me in the wheat field. Wait, I still have... He's not one to sit and chat, is he? I suppose not. Come, Roz. Let's get going. Best keep them to myself for now. It's always so disorienting when I see it do that little, uh... There we go. Uh, why do I feel like if I go through here, it's gonna fall? I think there's something... Yeah, it's a crow tablet. Items...
There we go. Easy peasy. There's something that popped up a question mark. Well, I guess it's gone now. But what? Yes, another crow slate. Okay, so do I have to go over there? I think I do. Let's see. Borrow that, don't mind me. He get wrecked. There we go. We're just gonna slap that. Ugh, goodness gracious. Uh, items. There we go. Easy peasy. Thinks there's something supposed to fit in here? Yes. Okay, so same thing. Alright, let's see. Where else have we not checked? Uh, do I have to go down? No? Okay. Uh, let's go back this way? Ah, uh, no. Did I mess up? Wait a second. Um, find a way to open all these, yes. I didn't see another one laying around. Do I have to go, like, and pull it out through the ones that I've already been through? The tongue be a moving, it do be a moving. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I was standing right in the way of an enemy. <laughs> okay, so yes. Gotcha, okay. So it looks like if I... Come back up here. Put this in here. It's not a skill issue! Ever had a skill issue? Hello, hello, Venom, Venomous. How do thou? Who? How? how that words. Yes. How do you do? Well, welcome, welcome to the party of me. I, I guess I'm kind of selling my soul, but I'm not actually certain. If that's what you'd call it. Nah, nah, nah. You're, 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 you're imagining it. Good, that's good. Bada bang, bada boom, baby. What you gotta say to me, bird? Halt there, lass. What is it? 
Show it to me. That brooch on your chest. You'd best not. You can see it plenty from where you're perched. Look how it shines. Look how it shines. Come closer. Come closer. Oh, get your own brooch, you greedy bird. Time to lose more of my sanity. Let's go. Ah, oh, how long has it been, I wonder? Tell me, how long has it been? Since when? Since you were bamboozled by one of us. Why, you? I'm not like the others. I'm not one to share my sorrows. You'll be joining us soon enough, whether you like it or not. Out of my sight, you. Look at your face. Look at your face. Oh, for goodness sake, everything in here is infuriating. Oh, you didn't even give me anything. Wow, wow, wow. That was a waste of my precious sanity. Anything? This game could take pity on me and give me, a, like, at least a sanity item in the dungeons. Let's see, let's see. Oh, goodness gracious, Roz! Woman! This is why we can't have nice things, woman. Here we go. All nice and safe before I run for my life. No, you'll be fine. She'll be fine. She I see where she's at. Ah! Of course you're going to keep me from finding Roz. Fine, fine. Hi, Roz. Hi, Roz. You flighty child. Impressive, Laz. Impressive. Okay. What's gotten into you, Roz? Who's Roz? Who's Roz? Uh. Ever since we got here, you haven't... Who's Roz, Marine? Dot, dot, dot. Oh, my goodness gracious. Someone put a child leash on this woman. You're just in time for the tender flesh, lass. The testament, the testament. My eye! The tender flesh? Rather peckish. I'm telling you to stay away from me. Could eat a horse? No, wait. May thy flesh serve him, may thy flesh serve him! Can I just die? Oh wait, no, I was hallucinating. Okay. Okay. He. <laughs> oh, whoops. Is this the flesh? My own hair? A part of me. My mortal body. Just like Roz told me. Oh, I gotta find her. Lord knows what those crows did to her. Let's just go ahead and... I should have told her to stay home. Looking for any pots or any glowy glowing items. Okay, there's nothing. Just a tree. Roz! It is, uh... Can you hear it, Elise? The woodland, my grove. It's aching. <gasps> what are you saying, Roz? You've lost your wits the moment we got here. Mm. Even under their influence, it's still... <laughs> I'm serious, Roz! That's enough! It's aching for what is taken from its bosom, Elise. Now that you're here, it's reacting to you. I still don't understand, Roz. What are... Can you hear it? Hear what? Mm. These roots, the earth... Oh my goodness gracious. 
I'll guide you to your rightful place, Elise. I don't have time for this nonsense, Roz. I've done what I came here to do. We ought to leave. To the woman, Elise. Where you were conceived, where will you go to meet your fate? You're not listening. I think he's once more trying to take you away from me. Turn my bosom into this parched wasteland, and yet... This womb of mine still responds to your presence all the same? Honey. What in the... I will bring you home, Elise. I will do everything in my power to... Ross, take my hand! We run. What in the... I will bring you home, Elise. Come with me, Roz! You have to get out of here! Oh, what in the cinnamon toast? Blah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Apparently, the good news just keeps on coming! See, part of me feels like I should probably- I can't pull out my lantern. <laughs> okay, so the blocks slow it down. I should have saved before before I started running. I mean, I really should have saved. I, I knew it was coming, and yet I didn't. And now look where we're at. Back at the beginning. We're just gonna... Oh, it won't let me skip this one. Okay. That's fine. Hmm. Just gonna speed run. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, yes, yes. I know, I know. Take me home, country roads. <laughs> yes. The womb. Anyways, I think I found out what happened to the horses. There we go. Hello, hello. How how do I do? Have you come to watch me have walls dropped on my head as I run away from a demented horse? I just wanted to romance cute girls. And look where that led me. I'm gonna slow it down a little bit. It's okay. Gotta get enough space. Ah, that was a long wall. Oh no! no! Are cute girls worth it though? Are they? My real reaction. I I won, yes. We say winning. What the 
Ross, keep up. I'll leave you behind. <laughs> that was not a deer lord, Elise. That was a horse lord. Is it... Is it gone, Ross? Hmm. I suppose. What was that? What the horse doing? What was that? Uh, I believe... That was not a horse. I believe that might have been the reincarnation of Dulahan. Or Armageddon. I don't know. Something, something, entropy of the universe. They're preparing for your arrival, it seems. <gasps> Nani? Nani? That's, that's me. Hmm. I've never seen him this eager, I must say. <laughs> what in the Lord's name is going on here? That, that was a great joke, okay? I thought it was clever. But I will give you your grow. Just, uh... You'll slip away. If I don't hurry, I'll lose you. Roz, what the f is wrong with you? Elise! I've had it! We're leaving this place! Thank you! Give me some acorns. Let me see. Let me let me let me gloat at myself real fast. A statue of me. Trying to lure you in, is he? Huh? Isn't this what you most desire? Glory, luxury, prestige. He is trying to show you that. Let's get out of here, Roz. Wonder if there's any things any super secrets behind the statue. No? Okay. Goodness gracious! I almost feel bad. Oh! Come quick, you have to get up! I will lose you again, my beloved! If I don't hurry, it'll slip away. You're not Roz. So, Eepy. If you're Eepy, then you should go Eepy. And out the woods I run. Oh, no. Oh wait, okay, it just it was just running into my bed. Oh, oh what am I to do? I feel so confused. Wait, right? Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing or where I'm going. That wasn't Raw's either. Bonk. Oh, what am I getting myself into? I'm so utterly alone. Let me guide you, Elise. Roz. My girl done got possessed. See? Cute girls. Perfect. Wait, can I can I We're just gonna enjoy the music for a second. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna sip. If you don't like cute girls, then we're gonna have to. We might have to do a duel. Oh, no. Bro, Roz is just so stinking cute, though, okay? How could you not love her?
Like, I, ju I just want to give her a hug. You like cute boys? I, I, I mean, I, yeah, I like cute boys, too. I, I like things that are cute. Because, like, look, there's a little goat. He's a cute, he's a cute little boy. I mean, I grant he's an animal, but... Oh, I just realized this was like a- that, this was actually like lore related. Is that- is that bad? Like, I thought that was just like an interlude? <laughs> when did I get here? I'm not a furry! I just like cute animals. Dream I had about Roz. Exclamation point. Roz, I have to find her. My eye. That, that freaking bird. I have to find Roz. Oh, actually, I was supposed to have a date with her this morning. Wow, she's gonna be downstairs. Oh, she's not downstairs. Okay, let's go back into the outhouse. Hi, Flock. Little, little dude. There we go. Roz! Uh, good morning, Elise. Have you completely lost your wits, Roz? Last night in the woods, what were you thinking, saying? Oh, I'm sorry, that wasn't... You weren't yourself, were you? What do you mean? Oh, don't give me that BS now. Uh, no, Elise, I didn't even step foot in the woods. You were with me the entire time! No, I wasn't. I couldn't follow you into the woods. The trees blocked my path. You went on ahead, no matter how much I called for you, and I... I did wait for you, but you never came back for me. If that wasn't Roz, then who in the Lord's name? You look a little... Roz. You can talk to me. You don't have to keep it all to yourself. I had a dream about you. It was... Oh, Elise. I saw you and your grandmother, and... It felt like I was seeing your... My path to finding you in Kefferberg. Oh, Elise, it's fate. Fate, you say? You still don't believe it, do you? Hard not to after last night. Oh, did you get it? Huh? Why, the testament, of course. Yes, I... Those crows, they... I was offered a strand of my own hair, and... Oh, Elise, that's wonderful. All you need to do is prepare it to be... Wait, what? Remember, these are gifts that you're giving to him, Elise, but it's... hair. A part of your own mortal body, yes. No, I do not deny it. I am simply confirming a truth. Boom is not, and will never be, a furry. Kiss for the host. Good drink and good company. Food, you say? The tender flesh needs to be food? You look tired, Elise. Is everything alright? I feel like I'm losing my wits, Roz. Elise. Come now, let's head out to work. Everything's falling into place, Elise. You'll see. Okay. Head to Kefferberg. Alright, let me go sell... That's not how that works! Venomous, tell him I'm not a furry. Let me go ahead and save before I regret it. I wonder if, like, I was, like, 
r romancing any of the other characters if they would have come into the woods with me. Or if it would have still been Roz. Alright, I am gonna have to go get some grape juice today, though. Or else I'm gonna go cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Oh goodness gracious, there's crows. <laughs> there's a lot of crows. Oh my. Oh, there's so many crows. What are these crows doing here? Elise, is everything all right? This can't be good. I'm best hurry. Oh, there's a lot, a lot of crows. Oh, there you are. Lev asked me to warn you two. Oh, poor Apfel struck a dreadful fever. Lev and Liz were up all night looking after him. Is he alright? Seems so, but after that high of fever, I wouldn't want him falling about too much. Where is he now? In church, I believe. Lev said Father Hans intends to keep watch over him today. Father Hans? Oh, it's one thing after another here in Kefferberg, isn't it? Honestly, I was hoping that she was going to give me some items. It's always lovely seeing you, so let's see what you'll buy. There we go. Okay, so acorns don't really sell for much. Oh well. Oh, it says on the side how much they sell for. <laughs> Nope, see you, Granny. There you go, so now I have money to buy the t tiny child whatever she wants. I can satisfy Mitzi. What's all this? What's a poo moment right there? I don't think I've ever seen so many crows at once. Come, Rose Roz. We must find out what's going on. Alright, let me save just in case anything increases my suspicion. We'll be scraping bird poof off the roof for weeks, Elma. Oh, Elise, would you take a look at this nonsense? These crows, I see. All of Kefferberg is thick with the filthy things. I told everyone I'd seen them yesterday, Miss Elma. They're a pest, and Lord knows where they've come from. Oh, but they're not dangerous, I'm certain. What are you saying, lass? Of course they are. You best talk some sense into your cousin, Elise. She's clearly not all there, the poor lass. All right, let's go, Roz. Ah, yes. Okay. Let me go... What if I run over here if I'll trigger a cutscene or anything? Let's see. There really are a lot of crows. But... These smell awful. Wait to be fed to livestock. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's go talk to, to, um, <clears throat> ma'am. Sup, ma'am. Let me buy. I can't, 
can't afford that. Oh, no. Okay, I'll just buy two. If I can just maintain my sanity. Then I think that I'm doing good. So I don't I don't know if there's any like harm of having it slightly lower, right? Let's just go up here and see if they're standing there again. No. Okay, let's go up a little bit more. Oh, yep, there they are. I'll take good care of it, Father. <sighs> There's nothing to see here, Elise. You best head back to town. You were the one who first saw these crows, weren't you, Elise? Hmm. It's not as though you folks believed me when I meant it mattered. I said it last night and I'll say it again. You're hiding. Hmm. It matters not all, Johan. I love how everyone's just getting tired of Johan's crap. <laughs> they don't even let him finish his sentences. We must focus on the matter at hand. We all had our fill of trouble last night, didn't we? We don't need any more yelling, that's for certain. <sighs> now, they didn't steal that much grain, folks. How much did they steal, Mr. Gustav? About a sack in total. We got here in time to prevent the worst. The darn birds were building a nest in the oven. We ought to give it a good scrubbing later. It doesn't seem they're keen on attacking us, at least. We've locked it up and trust Yugen here to find it with the key for now. I appreciate the trust. Of course, especially after all of yesterday's going on. Because he was stolen from or because he has no horses to steal the grain with? Yugen's a thief. <laughs> Who's the stand guard here, then? Mm -hmm. Before we get into that, Bernhard, there's something I'd like to say. We're all well aware of what happened last night. However, we ought to stick together, folks. Now more than ever. You heard the man. <laughs> Kefferberg's what we make of it. Don't forget that. Mm -hmm. I ought to head back to the church. Is Apfeld Ap feeling better, Father? Mm. That's what I'm looking into, Finn. Mm. You best go. Elise, Leb will fill you in, I'm certain. Will do, Mr. Gustav. Hmm. I was wondering, Elise. Mr. Bernard said that the crows were trying to make a nest in the oven. Hmm. I suppose it's a cozy little nook. I don't see what's so... So there's an oven in the mil windmill, right? There's always been an oven in the windmill, Roz. What's your... The tender flesh, Elise? Wouldn't this be a good way to prepare it? Oh. Making bread out of it, you say? Maybe you could ask about town if they'd let you in? That's rather risky, Roz. I suppose, but... I can't think of any other way. Not if... I want to find him. It's worth a try, I'd say. Alright, I'll see what I can find out. Alright, let's see what's on my... Next in the story, talk to the folks to investigate. All right, give me 30 seconds. I'll be right back.
gentlemen. I am back. There we go. My cats are being menaces. <laughs> and and what do you mean, really, you use that audio? <laughs> Wait, do I have audio on my on that screen? Thank you, thank you. I hope you didn't miss me too much. <sighs> I'd say they snuck in through the roof, Gustav. When did you realize the crows were in the windmill, Mr. Ludwig? Heinrich came back to collect some flour this morning. He was the one who gave the alert. So you've locked it up, have you? We must keep those birds out, Elise, or they'll take all of our grain. Ah, which one's not gonna draw me any suspicion? Oh, oh wait, wait, that one says red, that one's red, this one's yellow. I can't tell if that's... Just what it's flashing over? I like saying you like to keep guard, but isn't this a little much? What are you doing shifts, Leaf? Good start and Bernard are up first. I see. Do you want to stand guard with us, Elise? I hope you weren't planning on making any bread today, lass. Uh, I was, actually. Might want to get some from Gretel today, Elise. Are, are you certain you're not leaving, Mr. Ludwig? Wouldn't be the wisest to leave it to the crows, would it? I suppose not. You can have a word with Yugen if you're that keen on baking bread today. I must ask, though. Why are you so insistent, Elise? I, uh, I was, um... I best go see how Apfel's doing, if you'll excuse me. No! Goodness gracious. Oh, my suspicion is getting so high! I'm gonna- I'm gonna sob. Thank you, thank you. Let's see. Oh, I also need to find... Pestering child. Wait, what? Okay, okay. The fact that Lev doesn't just like, I mean, uh, Muffy doesn't just come and hunt us down. Statue of fish stands in its center. Oh, I'm stuck. There we go. I'm no longer stuck. So let me find her, and then I'll go, and I will talk to the leprechaun. That's gonna take me up there. Yes, bark, bark, indeed, puppers. Bark, bark, indeed. Why does this look like the old hag that's, like, been harassing me? Mr. Odeal? Don't tell me you're hiding from the crows. I'm not going anywhere near those dreadful things. Oh, this is all your fault? Oh, I wow. You two are hiding something, I know it. Oh, Johan's being taken for a fool, but I know you. It's because of what I said yesterday, Mrs. Odeal. All these awful going-ons. I understand it's frightening, Miss Odeal, but you can't- Oh, but these crows weren't enough. Even our children are hexed now. What are you- Shoot, shoot, leave me be you. Well, she's pleasant. <laughs> Let's see. Um...
It's a little annoying that they make it seem like feeding Muffy is an option, and then... No, if you don't feed her, she she's an active hindrance. Let's see. Let's go talk to Leb. Ah, it's nice to see you, Elise. You've heard about Apfel, I'm assume. I only heard he was ill, but that's all. Oh, the poor lad. He can't bear looking at his little hands. What about them, Miss Dorothy? It's best you hear it from me, Elise, so you get the real story. You've been up all night, Lisbeth. We can t we can tell her. That fellow is fine now, as you can see, but last night he... I was awoken by him moaning, speaking nonsense. His fever was boiling him alive. I... We called for Father Hans and brought him to church, but... Athel had never been so ill, I thought I'd lose him. He wasn't all there, either, and kept mumbling to himself, and I... I don't know how, but his hands are injured. It's horrifying, and they were so bloody. It's as if they were pecked at by something. I can't explain it. Uh... Please collect yourself, Miss Lisbeth. <sighs> That's right, Miss Lisbeth. Take deep breaths. At first I thought he caught the goat's sickness somehow, but... It doesn't explain his hands or what happened to my goats. Oh, this is my disgrace. It's alright, Mrs. Lisbeth. We're all here for you. It's alright. Um, what about the goats? It must have happened while we were praying for Apfel in church. When Miss Lisbeth went to fetch him in dry clothes, she happened upon two of her goats lying on the ground. They bled to death, their tongues had been ripped out, and their heads were severed, too. Yeah, that's a gruesome thought. You can rest assured that will help you, Miss Lisbeth. I shall arrange for a doctor to come as soon as possible. What am I to do with one sick goat, father? I'll make certain you and the children don't go without, Miss Lisbeth. You're welcome to have such. T you're welcome to have supper with Flynn and I, or Finn and I, anytime, Miss Lisbeth. Thank you, but I don't have the strength, Dorothy. Mm. Miss Dorothy will be looking after Apfel, Miss Lisbeth. You'd best go home and rest for the day. Of course, Father. Thank you. Mm. Come, I'll walk with you and Apfel alone. Uh, no. This is awful, Elise. Mm. I ought to pay them a visit later. It's one thing after another, isn't it? But first things first, I ought to figure out how I'm gonna get my hands on that key. Alright, what's my romantic date? Okay, so I gotta go to the review point. I don't actually know where the view point is. Oh, right there, okay. Let's see... Let's just... I want to see if there's anything I need- I can buy from her. I don't actually even remember how much money I have right now, but... Let me see... Yeah, I can't buy anything from there. Okay! Okay. Yep, I'm sure that- well, actually, let's see if there's anything I can sell to her. 
Okay, so she's not interested in key items. I don't have any normal items. Can't sell that. Um... Okay, no, she doesn't buy anything that I have. Sob. Yes, I'm sure that's all. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Alright, let's go on a date! Let's romance some cute girls! Well, at least though, with all the with all the birds, if they need feathers, then they definitely have feathers. Ah, uh, let's see. What do I have as far as food? Because apparently, I have to bring her along for all my food. So it's basically gone to instead of needing six feet or. Five pieces of food a day, sorry. I need... a lot more. Everything has suddenly gotten very expensive. Viewpoint is this way. There we go, yes. Oh, and that's open now. There she is. Yes, I'll spend some time with her. Look. You and that goat of yours, Roz. Well, at least there's no need to be jealous. I ain't jealous of no goat. What am I, a furry? I'm not jealous of a goat, you! Isn't she, Flock? <laughs> How would you like to sleep with him out in the granary, Roz? Uh, I'd have Flock to hold close. I wouldn't be cold at all. And the goat would be happy about it. Why, you? Ah, uh, Flock, don't get so close to the edge. You be careful, too, Roz. You can see everything from here, can't you? I suppose... Something's on your mind, Elise. I can tell. Can't even let to brood in peace, can I? <laughs> Just like me for will for will. You're going through some changes, that's all. Some changes, you say. Your path will become clearer and clearer. You'll see. Uh... I don't know about this. Not now, Roz. I'm not ready. You're still overwhelmed, I see. It's difficult not to be, wouldn't you say? Why don't we head back to town, Elise? Dot, dot, dot. <gasps> Did I mess up? <gasps> ah! No, I messed up! I didn't get a heart piece. Oh, no. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, wait, no, I have another chance. Okay, shoo! Okay, so it's the afternoon now. So let's go... Oh, whoops. Let's go find some work to do, get some money. Okay, so she's not in my party, so I don't know if it'll punish me for not doing any work with her today, though. I really don't know if I can afford to gain any more suspicion, because I don't know how to get it down. Um, let's see, though. I guess we'll find out, right? Eh. 
And let's go into town. Um. Oh, I also gotta look for Muffy, don't I? Oh, that little terror will be a menace. Um, so let's see. Oh, there's the little terror. It's you, little turd. That's enough. I'm not giving you one more crumb. But you promised. You promised me some lib. Lib kuchin. I promised you nothing, Mercy. Folks already think it's strange, Elise, that you knew about the, the cr cr crow since yesterday. You know what? Why don't you go ahead? Who to believe a scrawny little squealer like you anyhow? Oh, Josen does, Elise. Mr. Odile does, too. Oh, do they? What are you telling them, then? <gasps> then I saw you talking to those cr cr crows yesterday. There was a g golden one, too, wasn't there? <laughs> Why, you? <laughs> Following you about town is truly so much fun, Elise. <laughs> I, I just know you have the lepkin you promised tucked away somewhere. You keep your mouth shut, you hear? I don't want to add any more to these folks' imaginations. <laughs> Why, but they're not, not imagining anything, are they? <laughs> shut it, Muddy. Not one more word about this. <laughs> I'll keep quiet, but I was wondering. I gave you what you wanted, so go away. Alright, but wh why don't you bring me some soup tomorrow? <laughs> Off with you, Mandy! <laughs> I suppose I'll be safe for today. Okay, okay, so it reduces suspicion if I feed the child. Something, something, do not feed the ruminant animals. So let's save. And do I have... How much food do I have, too? Um, okay. Let's see. Let's have her come... Can I have her come with me? No, I don't think we can count on that. I should have chosen my words a little more carefully. That's all right, Elise. We'll find a way. It's a little late for that, Roz. If only I could turn back time and attempt it again. You haven't been asking about town yourself, have you? No, of course not. All right, well, I'll call for you if I need you. I'll be here. Should I... Wait, no, I can't. I saved over it. Crud. Uh, let me go... Well, no, I actually... I don't think I need... But she's not in my party, so she's not gonna... She's not gonna blab. And if she does, I hit her with the broom. Okay, I don't want to do that one. I'm just gonna stick to the games that I know. Let's go north. I think it's north. We'll figure that out. There we go. Are you wanting to eat a lot of eggs, Elise? What else is there to eat in this town, anyhow? Oh, you have enough for a hog or two, I'm certain. Huh. Anyhow, won't you fetch me a few eggs for supper? Alrighty. Let's have you pitch in for that hog, what do you say? If you bring me the entire coop, I will. <sighs> out of my way, you feather. Okay, let's see. Let's see if this is gonna like make me pass out from no food. We'll try, we'll try it. Worst case scenario, I perish. Alright, alright, gamer face. We're gonna we're gonna get we're gonna get a perfect score. We're gonna get all the eggs.
Okay, okay, okay. It's okay. Everything is perfect. Oh, it punishes you for picking out an empty nest, too. Okay, 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 I got 30. I think I got 30. That might be enough for an A. It's still a B? Oh, I'm not gonna try again. No. But I passed. Here, for your hard work. I'll be eating well tonight, that's for certain. Okay. Okay, let's see. Maybe? Ah, oh, beans. Okay, I just- I just- I just died. Imagine starving to death because you wanted your friend's help with some chickens. Okay, so let's go buy some bread. What was the last thing I... Where was I at? Uh, let me see. Items. Okay. It's okay. All right, let's go back to the bakery. Here we go. What can I do for you? I'm buying. Yeah, we'll just do that for right now. Anything else? No. See you, Granny. Uh, bread. Eat. And then we're gonna head back there. Okay, I think the jobs are the same, right? So I just need to go the same way. And now that I have three, I should... ...not perish if I decide to... Are you wanna eat eggs? Yes, there we go, come on. Yep, alright, Mr. Wilhelm. Yes. Alright, let's see if that'll make me starve to death. Alright, let's see if I can get that A this time. I think I- I think I can! I'm just built that way. Alright, gamer mode activated. I don't think I'm getting my 30. I don't think I'm getting that A this time. No, beans. I wonder if I lose time every time I get, like, bit by a chicken. Okay, I got 27. That should be a B. 
Glad to see. Okay, yeah, still have these, so I'll still get a good amount of money. Then I can go buy some more bread. Yes, I passed. Thank you. Enjoy your eggs. Okay, let's see. Because I technically haven't starved yet. I lied. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, let's see. Yes, continue. I wonder if there's anything at the end that will give me, like, two pieces of... Two pieces of food instead of just one. Let's see. Even if it's slightly more. Let's see. Shop. There we go. Mm -mm -mm. Hello, hello. Thank you, Miss Welma. For gracing me with your presence. Uh, hearty soup. Uh, two hunger, two that, but I don't have enough money. Oh, uh, you don't sell anything that gives me food. Okay, so I'm gonna have to take that suspicion on her then. If I do well enough, I should be able to get her for at least the second batch, right? It's not like I can just go steal an apple and eat it. I've honed my egg grabbing skills. I don't need. I don't need Roz. There we go. No. Unfortunately, I'm poor. What did I even buy that made you where I couldn't- that I have eight gold? Oh, I could have sold my acorns. Oh my goodness. I could have- I could have just- I, yeah. Then I would have bought two bread and I would have been fine. Let's see if I can get enough gold to justify not resetting the day again. on round one. Probably not that bad. Let's see. If I get at least 40 gold, I'm good. Maybe. Let's see how much it gives me. Yes, Chimkin. Let's see. Okay, 50. Yeah, okay. Let's go buy some bread.
because I don't think I have a romance thing that happens tonight. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. You better not be snitching. Here we go. Excuse me. Let me go buy some grain. I think I just need one to get me through this evening shift. Because then I'll get two free breads from Leb. Nope, that's it. Uh, items, bread. Go ahead and eat those anyways. Might as well, right? Um, and then we will go down. And then... What are my tasks that I can do? Maybe I'll chop wood or Elma with the apples. Sure, let's go kick some more goats. And chickens. Oh, wait. Um. I wonder if I can get at least 30 gold. Because she wants soup. I had to buy that from the inn. But I... Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. No, I'm trying to get to the shop. There we go. But I will actually buy a, buy the soup. Nope, I don't. I don't. I don't. No! R. There we go. Ooh. That'd be nice, but I can't afford that. There we go. Let's buy some soup. Yes, that'll be all for me, sweetheart. Goodbye, Miss Wilma, ma'am. And then you're just gonna stand there, woman. Items. Soup. Eat. There we go. That leaves me full health the next day. And let's see, what's this one? Help Marielle chop some wood. Is this Miss Marielle? Such a waste, isn't it? Oh, yes! Yes, okay, this is the wood. Of course. And then let's get bras, because I'll have enough food. As she's chopping wooden heels, she's styling. There we go. Okay, so it's E and R, I think, right? Yeah. R kick, E chop. Alright, let's go! Oh! Well, I already messed up. She bonked me. Okay, that's okay. We got this. Oh, did I finish it all? Did I get an A? <gasps> yes! 
Yes, I got an A! Woo! We're gonna be rich. No, I don't want to try again. There's no way I'm ever topping that. I won. Tell boss boss I won. Ah, so much money. All right, so let me see if the shop is still open. It is, cool. So I can buy my item. Buy some soup for the terror. There we go. Thank you. R. Actually, wait, no, that's not all. Let me buy some more juice. Maybe? Yes, I win, Re! <laughs> Are you sure? That's all? Yes, I'm sure. Goodbye, Miss Wilma. She just called me precious. I love her. Alright, let's go see Web. Okay, so I still can't go talk to Ro Roz at the windmill. Let me go ahead and save. Go, and we're just gonna avoid... Avoid interacting with people, and see if they leave me be. No! Please. There you are, Lassie. Huh? We need to have a word with you, Elise. A word with me, you say? Your cousin's been going about town spreading nonsense, Elise. Such as? Why, saying the crows are nothing to fret about, for instance. Ah! Uh... She isn't afraid of any animals, on the contrary. I see that might be true, Elise, but still, we're to be wary of such things, not make little of them. I understand, Miss Elma. This is dangerous. I ought to make certain I bring Roz to work with me. I'll have to deal with this every day. Oh good, thank goodness I didn't get any more suspicion. I promise she's a good girl. I know, Elise. I haven't said anything yet, have I? You don't have to, Elise. What am I to do with you, Lev? At least tell me you're gonna get a good night's sleep tonight. If nobody else breaks into a fever, I might. Here's your bread, Elise. Thanks, Elise. What's on your mind, Leb? Things that would upset you, Elise. I'm not certain you trust me at all. That's because I haven't spent- I haven't rizzed her up yet. I trust you enough not to ask about it. You keep coming back to this, Leb. If there's- I meant it, Elise. You don't have to tell me. Whatever it is you can't tell me, I won't pry. You trust me that much, huh? Even if you truly were the witch! Leb! I mean it, Elise. I trust you'll tell me, in time. Whenever you're ready. You're truly tired. For someone who's so attentive to others, Leb, you're not. I'll see you about town tomorrow. For goodness sake, you're so stubborn. Right, let me go ahead and crunchity munchity. Here we go. I'm nice and well fed, nice and healthy. A little bit nutty, but that's okay. Um, and I gotta just have to go have dinner with Roz. Oh no. Elise! Elise, come quick! What's the matter, Jacob? It's Apfel, he's gone missing! What? Oh, please come quick, Elise! I believe I'll have to do some damage control. <laughs> We must go and look for him. That's right, we can't sit about waiting forever. What's going on here? athel has gone missing, Elise. Hopefully the lads will find them on their patrol. They will happen upon him, I'm certain. They don't know he's missing, father. 
By the time they're back, my poor boy could have. <laughs> Mama! We all need to remain calm. Calm, father. My boy is missing! Lord knows if he's alright, let alone if the worst has happened. We all knew those crows were an omen. Not this again, you old wretch! Ought to have waken taken the lag to the witch! What a horrible thing to say, old Johan! You truly have no decency, you! We cannot give in to hysteria, brethren! Oh, to think the lads went out in search of the crows! The crows were a threat, lass! Oh, that's it! I'm going looking for him myself! I'll go. Let me be the one to go, Miss Elizabeth. Mm. It's best we wait for the lads. I can't allow... Oh, will you really, Elise? Now there's a brave lass. Oh, but Father Hans is right. It's dangerous. Leave it to me, Miss Elizabeth. Oh, Elise. Hmm. I do not condone your disobedience, Elise. I do. <laughs> it's like when your parents are arguing. And... Or, like, it's like, go to your father. <laughs> and they contradict each other. Truly, the poor lass can't be without a mother. We can lend a hand with whatever you need, Elise. You best make certain you have enough food and matches, dear. I'll be here, Elise. Let me know when you're leaving. Well, I dare say it's gonna be a long night. Find your way to the woods. Let's just do a little savey save. Let's see. And ta ta ta. I think I have plenty of matches, right? 18? Yeah. I'm a little poor, but that's okay. It's so depressing having to walk past this place every day. Smothered in overgrowth, the abandoned home, every nook and cranny is bursting with clumps of moss. I think I just walked past the woods, didn't I? No, 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 they're right there. Okay. Right, am I, am I doing the right thing? Find your way to the woods, yes. Then we go down and down and down. Into the woods we go. Here I am again. I also find out fell and fast. Let's see, will it let me go that way? No, okay. So I have to take the elevator. That's a different symbol this time, if anyone cares. It was a crow last time. Alright, let's see if these crows have anything to say to me this time. No? Okay. Uh-oh. Oh! A new path emerges! That crow's trying to tell me something, I suppose. No choice but to go the other way, I suppose. We love invisible walls. Let's see. This isn't where I was yesterday, is it? Apfel! Apfel! 
Can you hear me? Uh... I have to find him. Goodness knows what could have happened to him by now. I see a sparkly. Okay, I required a mosaic slab. Tile. Ignorance is bliss. Has no one ever told you that? Plenty of times, I suppose. Be unable to grasp how fortunate we are until it's too late. Charmingly tragic, isn't it? I don't think I'm so charming about it. You'll come to face to face with it, too. The ruinous grief your, of your biggest, heaviest regret. What's yours, then? The same as yours. We all share the same penitence. Talking to girls like this is nerve... Is it never a very pleasant experience, is it? I got a pearl rosary. A little bit more of my sanity disappears. A tile? Indeed. Let's see. I got some more acorns. Oh, please don't tell me I'm gonna have to do a puzzle. I'm not very good at puzzles. I'm not gonna lie. I think I need to find one more. Ouch! Oh, 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 oh. I might have jumped the gun just a tiny bit. Okay, invisible wall. Okay. I wonder if it's supposed to be missing two pieces, then. I didn't see where another piece could be. Or actually, I guess I could have literally just gone up a little bit more, huh? Yep, there it is. Okay. Let's see. Probably just the three if I'm being truthful. But I see vases. So I'm gonna break the- get whatever's in those vases, and then we're gonna go and... save. There we go. Why do I feel like I probably- oh yeah, let me go ahead and do my puzzle real fast. Oh, okay. And then... Items. Mosaic slab. There we go, and let's see if we can do it now. She's witless, she's witless. Why, you? Okay, so let's see. I think that's supposed to be at the top. Actually, wait, no, this might be a bottom piece. It is. Okay.
Welcome to uh, Poom Tries to Figure Out How to Solve a Puzzle for 10 Minutes. Go, and then we're gonna slide that one up. No. That went over. Down. This one over, this one up, this one this way. That didn't work at all! Okay, um... There's a trick to this, isn't there? myself in the same position. Oh, I knew. Okay, we're gonna get down the bottom row. Get this up one more. There we go. Okay. Now where do we go from here? Couldn't quite tell ya. But hey, at least I got off route by the foot. I'm gonna reckon this is probably the centerpiece. And yeah, it looks like that matches. Um well. Hmm. Uh well, maybe that's a center. That goes on the top. Maybe. What's it to ya? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, let's... Okay. Move this over. Shift that down. Shift that down. Shift this over. That goes up. This goes over. That goes down. This goes over. Up. Over. Down. Over. Up. Like that. Like that. No. Ah! Don't stop! Watch me! Ah! Uh, up. See, now I feel a lot of pressure, okay? Okay, well, I know that this goes in the corner. I don't- I don't know what goes in this bottom corner. That might be my blank piece, right? Um... 
This isn't like RuneScape. I can't just go online and be like, oh yeah, show me solutions. No, I don't want to do that. Um... No. Let's shift those over to the side. We'll drop this down. Bring this over. Bring that over. Bring that up. Bring that over. things. I don't have time for this nonsense. I ought to... I have to find Apfel. See, I did it and it didn't take me 20 minutes. It's gotta be worth something, right? You try to do it! It's not as easy as it looks! Sliding puzzle. It's not my fault. <laughs> That's my house. Must be losing my mind. No. <laughs> uh. What is what is this? My house. My progeny, at least. Who's there? Come closer, Elise. Delve deeper into my grove. What in the Lord's name? Your fate, Elise. Your genesis is in the tapestry. I do not! I have- I have brain cells. This isn't Granny Spindle. Nothing that's in here is real. It can't be. The whole upper floor is missing. Now leading nowhere. The staircase's wrinkly and damaged steps are suspended as though floating in midair. Well, I guess there's no going upstairs, huh? Well, let's out deeper into the tapestry. That woman. She wished for a child of her own. At his doorstep, she kneeled and she prayed. Not to me, but to him. I- I do not share my brain cell! Ah, I normally could have solved it very quickly. I'm just not very good at puzzles. My girl became the vessel, my soul, the babe's mortal body. In my very womb, they celebrated their agreement. From him came what I lack and what I failed to lay my hands upon. A human soul to be nurtured in my womb and later given to her as her daughter. Apparently, uh, Grandma Holly sold her soul. When in truth, 
It's me. Your body belongs to Elise. What? In the Lord's name, there's something under that tapestry. We're just gonna pull it back. Is that a baby sheep? Honey. This dough, its insides have been... My womb. Used for that woman's wish. I was used. Used! 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 Used? What in the Lord's name is going on here? What are these voices trying to tell me? I don't want to look at it. Blood tings the tapestry's bottom half, thoroughly coating each stitch in deep red filth. There we go. You're wearing my brooch still. Huh? What does one to do when the Lord fails them, would you say? Wait, what are you- Our union was favored by the Lord himself, and yet... My inability to bear a child drove a wedge between us. Who are you? So I did what I could. I resorted to his blessing instead. I brought him my beloved in exchange for our baby. Wait, you can't be- All I can say to you, Elise- Who's following in my steps is that this is what my soulmate would have wanted me to do. For my sake, for our union's sake, and for yours as well. That lass, it's as if she knew me. I, I don't know what's going on here, but I can't stay here any longer. I have to find and save Apfel. Oh, well, there we go. The path was revealed. Whatever was in the center is gone, I suppose. Several candles stand in a circle surrounding an old blood-stained piece of cloth. What's my sanity at? Okay, I still got a little bit of... I still got a couple marbles rolling around up there. You know what? The game ever tells me to save, I'm taking advantage of it. There we go. The game has given me an awful lot of acorns. Oh, ha, I can walk on that. That's not a wall. More acorns. At least I can sell them, though. Oh, okay. That was it. Oh, there's a child. Oh, a dead child. Okay. At fell. Hey, hold tight. I'll get you out of there. I don't think we will. Tell you the truth. Let's get you out of here and go home. Roz. Uh oh. The woodland, this grove, it's aching. Roz? Your flesh, your blood, your love. All that's rightfully mine, my progeny. Th this thing's not Roz. I can give you all that you desire. What? My beloved daughter. What? What are you? This lass, Rosemary. Is she the one your heart desires? What? What are you? They're coming. We will meet again. Hello. It's the Golden Quo. A vile stench. A vile stench. Tainting our grove. And it's you. The lad's staying where he is, lassie. The lad's staying, the lad's staying. Apfel, come now. Elise. Quickly, Apfel. We have to leave this place. That creature brought him right into our beaks, lass. We're not about to waste a hearty meal. Ah, my eye. 
Come, Epfel. We'll curse you. Dare not defy me. Leave the lad. Uh-oh. Epfel, run. I can't- I can't move, Elise! My legs, they're moving on their own! We have to leave this place, Epfel. Elise, I'm scared! Come, Epfel, we have to move. Oh, am I having to watch two people now? What is this, Dota? Uh- Um... <laughs> I, I don't think I'm making it. Um... I wonder if the- oh, hold on. Let me- let me just... I'm just gonna draw a little diagram real fast because if I die here, I'm not gonna remember. So it looks like it's uh, six, six squares, five squares. Okay, hold on. By, okay, we'll do a five by five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we're just gonna mark the safe tiles. Safe. And safe. That's all I have for right now. I suppose that's probably why they actually gave me so many, uh, healing items, huh? Let's see. Okay. Everything's fine. I'm practically a professional at this. Don't worry about it. Yes, I know. And now the sky is bleeding. We're just gonna speed run. Okay, so I've learned that I can actually take my time, though, on this. That I'm not getting chased by anything. Because, let, let, I'm gonna be honest with you, if I was running from something while I was doing that, oh god, that would've gone horribly. Okay, so let's see. Ah, pa pa pa. Okay, so that one's safe. Okay, so that one's safe. Okay, also safe. That's the only way we can go. That one's gotta be safe. Likewise. Okay. Okay, which one's not shaking? That one. Okay.
Okay. They're gonna go down. I'm slowly starting to learn that I might be a little bit impatient. Because if I had stopped the first time and just noticed that the tiles were shaking, I wouldn't have died. Okay, so they crumble if you backtrack. Alright, that one's not shaking. That one's not shaking. That one's shaking. That one's not. Bam! Easy peasy. Practically professional at this point. Elise. My eye. Where are we going? Watch your step, Apfel. We'll find a way. Okay, we're, so we're still linked. Easy. What's my health at? Okay. Let me save. Um, okay, so I need to walk him this way, and up, and left, then down. Oh, there's a spiky wall there. Let me eat a little bit. go. Oh, oh crud. There was a spiky wall. I love the implication that we're just walking this child into the wall. Oh, this is actually kind of tricky. So let's walk him down a little bit. Oh, crud. Um, I think I was supposed to go first. So I can't go that way. That's all spiky, isn't it? Yeah, it is. him into that corner? No. Let's tuck him into this corner. There we go. 
buy myself as much time as I can. Go, and so I can bring myself down. Go. Um, go here. And... Oh, crud. Okay, uh, let me eat some more acorns. I'm almost out. Well, there goes my idea of selling the acorns. Oh, that's a spiky wool. Okay. Um. Actually, this might be enough. Yes, it was. Okay. Shoo. At least I can't see where I'm going. Oh, the poor kid. I just kind of feel bad for him. Am I supposed to ensure that I don't lose sight of him? <laughs> oh crud. Did the child just- I think the child just perished. Okay. I think the goal is trying to get there before he does. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I waited too. I think I had probably hesitated a little bit too long right there when I was uh avoiding the bird when I was like worried about the birds. Um Let's see. Oh yeah, okay, cool. Oh, that wasn't a safe tree. Oh gosh, this is tricky. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, I got this. I got this. That's what they trained me for in the army. Okay, third time's charm, right? <laughs> okay, let's see. One hundred percent no damage speed run. Okay, okay, okay. We got this. We got this. Fourth time's a charm. I am Spice. Do I have to pay attention to more than one at once? Fifth time's a charm. Something, something, skill issue. It's okay. I'm getting discombobulated. <laughs> Piss. Okay. That was that was a throwaway. That doesn't count. This is this is still the fifth time. That was just that was just a little test to see if I could brute force it. There you go. All right, time number five. And then 
once he walks across, I run down to that second tree. Okay, I did it, I did it! any more acorns I don't the trees are alive yes the trees have eyes I'm coming for you wait there Where is the child? I'm with you now. <laughs> God gamer totally did it in one try. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You're all right. Okay, the little the little uh, drawing of Lisbeth is a lot cuter than her pixel. Not gonna lie. I was so scared, Mama. You're right now, my boy. Oh, I, well, I thought I'd never see you again. It's all right, my loves. We're together now. What a relief. Good Lord, Elise, you really did find him. It wasn't easy, that's for certain. And a girl, Elise. And a girl, indeed. I did do great. <laughs> Folks told us all about it. We were about to set off after you. <laughs> shaming pixels now, are we? Yes, I am shaming pixels. This is a moment to celebrate, folks. Prepare us a feast, Wilma. We're drinking to Elise tonight. Oh, how wonderful. I'll get right to it. I mean, same thing with Wilma's sprite as well. We can't compromise the festival, Wilma. There's nothing better to celebrate than this, Father. The lad's right, Father. We ought to celebrate. <laughs> to the end, folks! To the end! We're gonna drink to our heart's content. Party till we're purple, as they say. It is a... Elise! What are you doing here, Roz? You weren't coming back, so I came back for you. Oh, no. I saw you coming back with Apfel? He got lost in the woods. I went to look for him, is all. Oh, but is he alright? Say, Roz, you've been home this whole time, haven't you? Uh, yes, I made supper and everything. You were taking so long, I thought... Come, Elise, we ought to celebrate. I'll be right there, Mr. Heinrich. You head on home, Roz. Oh, alright. I won't take too long, alright? I'll be home waiting for you, okay? Goodbye, goodbye. Let's see. How much do I have? I think I have 10 gold, so I can probably buy. I think I can buy a healing item. Let's just go ahead and save, though. There we go. Yeah. 
I wonder if this will, like, heal me and give me food. Atta girl, Elise. Kefferberg owes you a great debt, lass. Lauren knows what could have happened had it not been for you. <laughs> it was lucky, is all. No, Elise. I owe you an apology. What matters is that Atfell is safe and sound, father. <laughs> Heinrich's right. We have a good reason to celebrate. Bottoms up, everyone. <laughs> to Elise, our bravest lass. To Elise. Oh, <laughs> you don't have to. Nonsense, lass. This be this is better than the festival, even. A great deal better, indeed. It's our chance to unwind, folks. Mm. Why don't you grab some ale and go grab Freya for a dance, Elise? <laughs> yeah. We're drinking all night long, lads. <laughs> to Elise! <laughs> Find your way- oh, well. Let's see if I can go in and buy a thing. No? Okay. Let's see. Ah! Bonfire. Everyone's partying. Meanwhile, I'm on my last legs. <laughs> Is the bread shop open? No, of course it's not. Alrighty, let's -a go. A Woohoo! Oh, that is. Here we go. I must go see... I gotta go see Roz. You know, we're gonna just assume it's like Minecraft, where, you know, if you sleep in your bed, you heal. Oh, wait, what? Find your way home. Yeah, I'm home. Let's go into my room. And let's take a nice little bitty bye. I suppose this is it. I can't help but feel like there's something else I should be doing, but... Nothing I can do about it now, huh? Oh, that was probably my time to break into the windmill, wasn't it? I don't feel like I got any sleep at all. Uh... It's best I go find Roz. Well, actually... It's a new day! I'm almost- I'm half dead, half starved! But I'm actually going to call it here. I feel like this is a good place to, you know, take a little break. We got two days done. I... I romance a cute girl. I didn't run from moths, but that's okay. I ran from birds instead. But, let me go ahead and... There we go. As always, everyone, you know, if you're still hanging out, thank you so much for coming. I appreciate you being here. And, you know... I will actually will not be streaming tomorrow because, you know, it's, it's turkey day. You know... Gotta go get a little chunk. But I will be back on Friday for some Cult of the Lamb. 
and hopefully I can see you there. I'm actually going to be starting a new playthrough. It's a game I've played before, but we're actually going to I'm going to do it on hard. Like the hardest difficulty I can find. Why? I don't know. But hopefully I can see you all there. And until next time, you know, have a great night. Stay hydrated and just remember, you're all cute.